for me is uh, more than a passion. It's uh, my way of expression. Uh, I sing for identity, for patrimony. I sing for love, for peace. I sing because I love singing. <laughs> is colored, talented, energetic youth. My Africa is the future. My name is Amal Zen. I'm a singer, songwriter, and composer from Algeria. And this is my Africa. <laughs> this is the style of uh, the local regions, and we call it Dainan. Singer-songwriter Amel Zen began her musical career at an early age in Shershel, a town on Algeria's Mediterranean coast. At 10, I asked my father to, to learn music, so he took me to the association uh, which called Al Qaisariya. It's an Andalusian uh, association of music. And uh, after this, I joined the regional orchestra and the national orchestra of Andalusian music of Algiers. After moving to Algiers to get her bachelor's degree in architecture, Amel took her music to a professional level. After getting my diploma in 2007, I participated to a TV show, a musical TV show, which called the Al Hanwa Shabab, and uh, I got a quarter final, and that's that uh, was the beginning with music. After her last two singles, Tlete and Sekum Bali, became breakout hits in Algeria, Amel became a regular on both national and international radio. I'm open to all music styles. Uh, I love discovering um, world music bands and I love mixing ethnic with world music and rock so uh, sounds. I did a lot of travels between 2014 and uh, 2016, and especially after, uh, after my participation to One Beat uh, program in US in 2016, where I met a lot of artists from around the world, from different cultures, from different ethnic, and there I understand the power of music. Music has the power to connect people, whatever their ethnicity, whatever their religion, their spirituality differences. And I, I think that music is the bridge. At the end, it connects human, and it's the goal of music. But despite her travels, Amel didn't forget her roots. I have a lot, a lot of things to, to, to tell about my country is a, a beautiful country, is a country continent. It's um, the largest country of Africa. It, Algeria is plural. Algeria is diversified in its culture, in music, uh, in accent, sounds. You can find humor in uh, every street corner. And uh, Algeria is controversial between uh, tradition and modernity. And I want to say that uh, when you know that you know her, Algeria surprises you. And uh, Algeria is a story to discover. We have a lot of rhythms. Uh, they change from a uh, region to another. And a lot of uh, ethnic uh, percussion, like a bendir. So with uh, Tufiq, we'll show you some of them and the difference from a region to another. Let's start with the, the west of the country, with Alawi, for example. The Heddi. Let's go to a folklore of Kabylie. I view my identity uh, as an African, as an Algerian, an Amazigh, a Maghreban. We find the uh, uh, similitude in the Dahra in the west about the percussion of Galal and, uh, and uh, Bandir in the Zendali uh, in the style of Dainan. 
You can uh, remember it. in uh, Turkey region and uh, Tindi, for example. Gubahi in Algiers. Malouf in Constantine. Not only is Amel working on spreading North African music across the world, she also actively takes part in social work and the upliftment of women. I'm very sensitive about children in difficulties because uh, when you help the children, you help the whole society, you help the nation and the humanity. Um, so I am active with the local association here in Algeria and uh, with an international organization, uh, UNICEF. Algeria. I raise my voice to fight uh, cancer and to do uh, a campaign to fight uh, AIDS and to break the taboos. I need to be useful to my society. I need to contribute to my society. Just uh, adding my voice to the chain, I give my voice uh, to, to, to fight uh, harassment, to fight the violence, to, to fight the, the extremism, the fundamentalism, and the all kind of violence. Her next album, Bridges, talks about exactly that. The fight for identity and the strength of music in building bridges between cultures and people. At the end, I want to say, uh, let's drop the walls and uh, create and build bridges. African Voices, in association with GLOW,